Hey everyone, welcome back to Gamer Pramod. In today's video, I'll show you how you can play RV There Yet, the super fun and chaotic survival road trip game, right on your Android device using the Game Hub emulator. Whether you want to drive your RV, use the winch, or survive attacks from bears and eagles, everything works perfectly on Android through Game Hub, and I'll guide you through every single step. So make sure you watch till the end, and don't forget to drop a like if this helps you. First, we need to download GameHub Emulator Lite version 5.1.yo, which allows you to run PC games directly on Android. Head over to the official GameHub GitHub Lite page, I'm using the Antutu version, and you can use the normal APK in case you want to. Once downloaded, install the APK and open the emulator. Click on Agree to accept the terms and conditions. Now it's time to add RV There Yet to your Game Hub library. If you already own the game on Steam, simply sign in with your Steam account inside Game Hub and import it. Or if you have the RV There Yet game files saved on your PC, just copy them to your phone. Then click on Import PC Games, allow the file storage permission, and select the game's .exe file from the stored location. After importing, all the necessary files required to run the game will begin downloading. Let all the resources download completely before continuing. Once everything is downloaded, go back and click on the three dots, then select PC settings. Under the General tab, set the resolution to 960x544. Next, go to the Compatibility tab. Set the translation params to extreme and change the GPU driver to Turnip V26 Revision 2 if you have a Snapdragon 8 Elite processor, or if you're using a Mali device, select the system driver instead. Keep the rest of the options at default. Now, head over to Touch Controls and enable them. From General Settings, launch the Container Desktop. Swipe left and turn on full screen and auto brightness. Then launch the game from the stored location. If it prompts you to install Microsoft Visual 2015 to 2022, click on install. It will complete in a few seconds. After that, the game should start automatically. In the main menu, you can start a new game, load an existing one, join multiplayer, or play with friends. But before jumping in, let's tweak a few settings for smoother performance. Go to Options, press the LT button to move into the Graphics tab, and set the FPS limit to 90 or 60 for better stability. Click X to apply the changes and start a new game. Name your game and start enjoying RV There Yet. Right on your Android device. I highly recommend using a game controller if you have one, since I personally found it a bit difficult to play with touch controls alone. With these settings, you can expect around 20 to 30 FPS, which provides a smooth and playable experience. Do note, during gameplay, your device might get a bit warm due to the processing load. So that's how you can play RV There Yet on Android using the Game Hub emulator. If this video helped you, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, and share this with your gaming friends. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.